Well, the second season of the renewed rivalry between Maryland and Georgetown is in the books. Alex Swum alongside Justin Meyer here. Terps eking out a 76-75 victory. Let's get right to the highlights. Let's start off with the final seconds. Just 17 seconds on the clock. Terps down three. Melo Trimble takes the ball off the inbound, weaves through defenders down the lane, lays it in the cup. Terps down by just one. Georgetown would step out of bounds. Trimble fouled. He goes to the line, hits both shots. Now Maryland up next. Something that will be talked about in College Park for a while. Georgetown down the other way. Jagan Mosley the ball. Kevin Herter the block says not today. Anthony Cowan takes the ball. The celebration ensues. You know, for us, it, we've been on the, the lucky side the last two years. Um, they... At the eight-minute timeout, both years they've been up six or eight, and we've been able somehow to win the games. But they pretty much had to lead all of the second half, and we just kept fighting. And you know, we, like Coach Turner said, we played with you know a group of freshmen out there that had never been in that environment before, and just for them to go out there and play the way they did and step up, you know, when we needed them to, was very special. So the Terps, they'll celebrate tonight, Justin, but it didn't look like they were going to win for a while. What did they struggle with throughout this game? Well, I'd say Georgetown and Maryland both struggled with fouls throughout the entire game. That was a huge, huge part of the game in general. Um, but Maryland in particular allowed Georgetown to stay in the game with their fouls. Uh, Georgetown, a ton of their points came at the free throw line. They didn't shoot particularly well today, but those free points at the free throw line, and they kept making them over and over again, that's what kept them in the game. And then what changed at the end of the game? What did the Terps do differently that allowed them to pick up the win? Well, toward the end, they let Melo Trimble take over. Uh, Trimble is one of the best drivers in the country, and they put shooters on the outside and they opened up lanes that way. Uh, it, it spaces the floor out and uh, allows Trimble to drive, draw a ton of fouls. Um, he scored 11 points in the last like three and a half minutes or so, five of those with the free throw line. Uh, that was a huge part of Merrill coming back. So Melo Trimble finished the game team leader with 22 points. Justin Jackson chipped in 17 as well and 11 from Anthony Cowan and one big block from Kevin Herter. Big win for the Terps, tough loss for Georgetown. Maryland will be back in action against St. Mary's on Thursday. We will have the coverage for you. But for now, for Justin Meyer and the Left Bench TV, I'm Alex Flum. Thanks for watching.